residential real estate and moving or navigating change. Today's question was from a seller. And the question was, how honest should I be on my seller's disclosure? The answer is very, please, I beg of you, be very honest on your seller's disclosure. A seller's disclosure is a document that's filled out by the seller and it talks about different things like the age of the roof, the age of the mechanicals, if there have been any water issues, if the septic system was replaced. The reason that you want to be very honest is that number one, you're not hiding anything. The buyers will bring in inspectors that will uncover these things. And if you didn't disclose it, they're gonna come back to you and negotiate. When those seller's disclosures are filled out, filled out accurately and honestly, as a listing agent, I can go back and negotiate that so they're not asking you for a lot more money in a credit. That's what you want. You want to be able to go back and say, we talked about this, you knew it. So there's no reason for you to come back and ask me for a credit. Now, if you're going to try and hide something and it's uncovered, there's reason to say that they should be able to ask you for a credit because you weren't honest. So really in negotiations, it's better if you're full disclosure on those seller's disclosures. If you have any questions about filling out those forms, what those forms are, or any other real estate questions, feel free to call or text or email me. My cell phone number is 551-206-9264, and I hope you have an awesome day.